Have you ever wondered who the snake, one of the most feared creatures in the animal kingdom, fears the most? In the fascinating world of wildlife, snakes are often regarded as the ultimate predators. Their long, slender bodies move with an eerie grace, slithering silently through the undergrowth. The scales shimmer under the sunlight, reflecting a myriad of colours that blend seamlessly with their surroundings. Equipped with venomous fangs or powerful constricting bodies, they are the embodiment of lethal elegance. Snakes are masters of stealth and ambush, lying in wait for their prey with patience that rivals the ticking of a clock. The rustle of leaves, the flicker of a shadow, a sudden lunge, and before the prey knows it, it's already too late. This is the predatory dance of the snake, a silent ballet of life and death played out in the heart of nature. However, contrary to popular belief, snakes aren't the invincible predators we often imagine them to be. They too have their fair share of threats to deal with. Yes, even these formidable hunters have their own set of predators to worry about. It's a common misconception that snakes sit atop their food chain, unthreatened and supreme. But the truth is, they too have to constantly look over their metaphorical shoulders. The life of a snake is more than just a predatory dance. It's a constant struggle for survival. Every slither, every flick of the tongue, every coil of the body is a testament to their innate survival instincts. They must not only hunt, but also avoid becoming the hunted. In the grand arena of the wild, every creature has its nemesis, its Achilles heel. For the gazelle, it's the lion. For the mouse, it's the owl. And for the snake, well, the answer might surprise you. But even the mighty snake has something to fear. The question is, who or what could this be? In the animal kingdom, the most unlikely creatures can become the fiercest rivals. Let's dive into the world of the snake's unexpected adversaries, those who, despite their diminutive stature, pose a serious threat. It's a tale of the small and stealthy, the underdogs, you might say, but rest assured they pack quite a punch. Take, for instance, the mongoose. This small furry creature might not look like much of a menace, but don't let its size fool you. With lightning-fast reflexes, a mongoose can dodge a snake's strike with astounding agility. Moreover, it's naturally resistant to snake venom, making it a formidable foe to venomous snakes. Then there's the honey badger. Now this little guy is a bundle of surprises. Considered one of the most fearless animals on the planet, honey badgers are known to attack and eat snakes. Their thick, loose skin allows them to wriggle free if a snake manages to get a grip. And just like the mongoose, they are also resistant to venom. But it's not just about physical prowess. These animals use the element of surprise to their advantage. A mongoose or a honey badger can sneak up on a snake, catching it off guard. It's this cunning strategy that often tips the scales in their favor during these encounters. These unlikely rivals of the snake serve as a reminder that in the animal kingdom, size isn't everything. It's about survival, about using what you've got to your advantage. Whether that's speed, venom resistance, or the art of surprise, these seemingly harmless creatures have it all. The mongoose and the honey badger, small yet fearless, prove that even the mightiest can be challenged. They embody the spirit of survival, demonstrating that courage and cunning can often outshine brute strength. But it's not just the small and stealthy creatures that snakes need to watch out for. High above in the sky, keen eyes watch the ground for the slightest movement. These eyes belong to the mighty birds of prey, the eagles, hawks and other raptors. In the wild, these feathered hunters are known to be natural enemies of snakes, engaging in an age-old rivalry that plays out in the skies and on the ground. Consider, for instance, the majestic eagle. With its razor-sharp talons and breathtaking agility, the eagle is a formidable adversary for any snake. When an eagle spots a snake from high above, it swoops down with deadly precision, seizing the serpent in its talons before the snake even realises what's happening. The eagle then takes flight, carrying its catch to a safe place to feast. Hawks, too, are adept snake hunters. These birds are smaller than eagles, but what they lack in size they make up for in agility and speed. Hawks employ a different strategy to catch snakes. They hover low, almost skimming the ground, and then strike suddenly, catching the snake off guard. Hawks are known to be particularly fond of smaller snake species, which they can easily carry off to their nests. But it's not always a one-sided battle. Some snakes, like the venomous rattlesnake, fight back. A rattlesnake's bite can be lethal to birds, and so 
These birds of prey have learned to adapt. They strike swiftly, aiming for the snake's head to avoid getting bitten. It's a dangerous game, but one that these birds have mastered over countless generations. These aerial battles are a testament to the intricate balance of nature. They remind us that every creature has its place in the ecosystem, its role to play in the grand scheme of life. And while snakes might seem invincible on the ground, the birds of prey in the skies pose a significant threat. The sky might be a dangerous place for snakes, but danger lurks in the water too. In the water, a different kind of predator lies in wait. In this watery world, the laws of the jungle are rewritten and new threats emerge, threats that even the most fearsome snakes must reckon with. Consider the crocodile, a creature that has roamed the earth for over 200 million years, a testament to its exceptional survival skills. These cold-blooded predators, with their rugged armor and powerful jaws, are a formidable adversary to any snake that dares to cross their path. A swift snap of the crocodile's jaws can spell the end for an unsuspecting snake. But the threats aren't solely from these massive reptiles. In the aquatic realm, even the small can be mighty. We turn our attention to the large fish species, who are often overlooked as predators. The catfish, for example, is an opportunist par excellence. It can consume almost anything that fits into its mouth, including snakes. In the blink of an eye, a snake can go from predator to prey. Here, in the watery depths, the struggle for survival is as relentless as on land, if not more so. The snake, a creature we often view as a symbol of danger and fear, becomes the hunted. This dynamic shift is a stark reminder of the delicate balance that exists in nature, a balance that ensures no one species reigns supreme indefinitely. To survive, snakes have had to adapt, to learn, and to respect these aquatic threats. They've developed strategies, honed their skills, and in some cases, even evolved to become semi-aquatic themselves. Yet even with these adaptations, they remain vulnerable, a testament to the relentless cycle of life and death that governs the natural world. So, as we've seen, the threats to snakes are not confined to the land or the sky. They are everywhere, even in the water, a place we might have thought safe. So snakes, formidable as they are, face threats from all corners of the animal kingdom. So, who really is the snake's worst enemy? It is a question that, as we've seen, can't be answered with a single name. The answer is as diverse as the natural world itself, spanning across continents and habitats, from the sky to the sea. We've taken a deep dive into the world of snakes and their predators. We've seen how the dance of predator and prey plays out in the wild, a dance as old as time, but ever evolving. We've met the unexpected rivals of snakes, creatures like honey badgers and mongoose, who despite their small size pack a formidable punch. We've soared with the birds of prey, raptors whose keen eyes and swift talons spell doom for any snake caught unawares. And we've plunged into the aquatic world where even snakes are not safe from the jaws of crocodiles and alligators. Each of these creatures in their own way poses a threat to snakes. Yet it's important to remember that this is not a tale of villains and heroes. It's a tale of balance, of the intricate web of life that binds us all. Every creature, whether predator or prey, plays a crucial role in maintaining the health of our ecosystems. The snake, despite its many foes, is an integral part of this balance, controlling rodent populations and providing food for larger predators. This balance, however, is delicate, easily disrupted by human activities. Habitat destruction, pollution, climate change. These are the real threats not only to snakes, but to all wildlife. So perhaps the snake's worst enemy is not another animal, but anyone who stands in the way of its survival. In the end, the snake's worst enemy might just be anyone who stands in the way of its survival. If you enjoyed this journey through the wild, don't forget to like, share and subscribe.